afternoon from somewhere in the uh, in the middle of Athens, Greece, and I am uh, here. I've been here just for uh, just under a day, and I was thinking of something to try to do today, and uh, I, I found this thing on Google Maps called uh, Mount Lycabetus or something like that. It's a uh, it's a hill here in Athens, and you climb it up, or you take a, I don't know, a nuclear or whatever. You find your way to the top, and in uh, and in doing so, it'll give you a beautiful panoramic view of the city of Athens. And I've heard that it's just spectacular to go up there and watch the sunset going down over the uh, would it be the Mediterranean? I think I'm not sure. I think so, but nonetheless, I'm going to bring you along. Now the uh, the climb, I've been told, is uh, is quite. Uh, it, it, it's quite arduous, if you will, and I'm about to find out. I've just uh, just begun, begun my ascent, I should say, up these steps here, and uh, I am on my way to the on my way to the top. And you know, as I walk along today, everywhere I go, I see these these fruit trees, and it you know it looked like uh, looked like oranges here, but uh, apparently they're not. Uh, they're not edible right off the tree, whatever that, whatever that fruit might be. But uh, boy, you sure see, you sure see these trees just everywhere. You walk around Athens, you'll see another one just over there. So nonetheless, I am, uh, I am walking up to see this view, and apparently it's quite a, uh, quite a climb. So I'm going to bring you along and we'll uh, check out the view. I was told to get a coffee up there by uh, one, of my, one of my many subscribers, lovely, uh, lovely Mary from, from Athens, told me I need to get a, uh, a Greek coffee when I'm up at the top. So Mary, I'm going to take your advice and I'm going to grab myself a coffee when I get up to the top. And hopefully, I'm gonna actually have a bite to eat with Mary, whom I've uh, yet to meet. But I've had several exchanges of correspondence with her. Now look at these, look at these homes here. Just all types of plants you can see out on the, out on the balconies. Look at that. So, who knows? This might be one of the this might be one of the posh neighborhoods here in Athens. So I'm going to continue continue the climb up and uh, hopefully share a spectacular view with you. All right, I've left the uh, the city streets behind me. And I'm just beginning to enter the park. And the name is Mount Lycabetus. I believe that's how you, how you pronounce it. Mount Lycabetus or something similar. And you can see there would be the, what I imagine to be the top up, uh, up that way. So we're gonna go up and I see cactus as I walk along. I was reading yesterday or rather checking into some videos on Greece and apparently half of half of Greece is forested land if I'm not uh, not mistaken. But nonetheless here we go and I I hope you pronounce it Mount Like Like a Betis. So we will uh somebody out there or somebody will uh let me know I'm sure. Just a little bit up further there's this view of the top and you can see the folks walking along the winding path to get up there. And I still have quite a ways to go, but nonetheless I just saw my first glimpse of the of the ocean and I'll 
share that with you. It's directly into the sun, so I'm not quite sure just how, uh, how well you'll be able to see it. But nonetheless, there you have it, folks. There is Athens. Wow. What a city. What a sprawling, sprawling city. And off in the distance is the, is the coast. And there's no shortage of ships out there. The water is just dotted with, with ships. So we're going to continue on the, continue on the path upward. And there's our, there's our destination right there. Here's a great view of the, of the cactus that you see here along the, the path going up. And I will uh, zoom up and show you the, the side of the, side of the cliff here. Look at that. Wonderful. All right, on we go. The sun's gone behind a cloud, and I can give you a, a really nice view of the water right now as I zoom out and pan the camera around. And here is a uh, nice couple catching the, uh, the scene here. They'll probably watch the sunset. But look at the uh, look at the view. What a sprawling city. You look out there, you'll see the see the ships out on the out on the sea there. Just up the path, it's this uh, artist selling his uh, his drawings or paintings. He's there making a sketch of something or another, and uh, he uh, just kind of oblivious to the people walking by. And then here you can see his his art, and the sign says, "So hard to be an artist." There's his there's his work. All right, so on with the uh, on with the climb. Well, you know, as I was walking along, I happened to look out, and I don't know why I didn't notice it before, but there are the there are some of the the ruins, the the Greek ruins. That's probably the the Acropolis, I would think, just off there in the distance. Well, you look at that. And I'll find my way find my way over there before this visit to Athens is true, I'm sure. Here's an interesting site that you just wouldn't really expect to see. Declarations of love on the cactus coming uh, coming up here to the top. Dami and Sina. Vika and Sergei. Look at that. What is this? Noel Noli loves Lore. Something like that. But uh, look at that. Ogre and Ogreen. Let's look at some of the other some of the other names here. Look at All right. There you have it. Let's find our way to the find our way to the top. It would appear that I made the top, and I say that as I see a gate coming in or going in, I should say, to what I would assume is the top. So let's go check this place out. You know, 
you take it slowly, it's not that bad of a, really not that bad of a climb. So we'll go up and check out the view. If I'm not mistaken, I believe that there is also a, a church up here at the, at the top. And I gotta give credit where credit is due and show you the beautiful Greek flag flying up there. So let's check out the top. Here we are folks, up at the top. Chapel of St. George, Lycabetus, founded in 1834. You can see. There it is. All right. A little bit smaller than I thought. Not a large, uh, not a real large area up here. There's a bell. But nonetheless, really a great, uh, great view for sure. Look at this. Wow. What a view. What a view. Look at the size of that city. Athens, Greece. I never imagined that I would be standing here in Athens on this trip. And I gotta give a big shout out to, to Mary. Beautiful, beautiful Mary who reached out to me somewhere along the line during this trip and uh, told me that I really should come and check out her beautiful home here in uh, in Athens. This is actually one of those videos that you do and you just know it's gonna just know it's gonna be a good good video. So we'll walk along. There's a gentleman over here selling selling some jewelry. If anybody wants to do some some shopping, you can look. Hello. I was on my way back and the gentleman who was trying to get my attention and I thought he wanted me to buy something but he actually wanted me to show you these here. Look at these beautiful traditional Greek jewelry. Beautiful. Just beautiful. Okay, so thank you, sir. And what's your name? My name is Christus. I'm sorry? This is one gift for you. Oh, a gift. Well, thank you. And how do, what, how, what's your name? Christus. Chris, Christus? Chris. Christus is Chris. Ah, nice to meet you. You're on Tom TV. All right, thank you very, very much. It's beautiful. Are you up here every day? Every day. So you see the sunset. You've seen many beautiful sunsets. Wonderful. I will stay and watch. Thank you. Boy, it's sprawling. Here I can give you a view. Looking down.
And here would be the restaurant where Mary suggested that I perhaps have a coffee. Maybe I will, in fact, do that. You can come and have yourself a nice, nice bite to eat with a, with a view to die for. Wonderful. Just want to make sure I don't miss, miss anything here. Try to give you the experience as if you were walking these steps yourself. Here comes a Greek woman here. I'm assuming she's Greek. Okay. TV. Great and wonderful are thy deeds, O Lord God, the Almighty, who shall not fear and glorify thy name, O Lord. Here's the daily menu. Chicken or moussaka with tzatziki. 13, 13 euro. Where you can get a soft ice cream for 3 euro. It's rather intimate. In a restaurant. Very nice. You can actually walk back through this way. Look at that view. Not sure what that is off in the, off in the distance. Maybe Mary will be watching this video and she can enlighten us as to what, what that is over there. Looks like some type of a outdoor theater. No, I don't have any. And there's the view looking down. Okay. So that shall that's gonna do your your tour of this beautiful spot in this beautiful city hope you enjoyed the uh, hope you enjoyed the visit so interestingly enough that lovely lady that uh, I saw walking out from the restaurant must have been on a short break because she is here in the chapel or the church and uh, seems to be a wonderful lady she was calling to a woman who dropped some change into the donation box to, to take a candle and I will uh, I will do that as well. I'm going to take a candle and drop a little bit of donation into the into the box here and I'm going to share this beautiful beautiful church with you as much as I'm, as much as I'm able to so really a special special place look at this. Wonderful. Isn't that beautiful? All the ceilings are, are painted. You can see. Maybe we can zoom in and share some of that with you. Isn't that nice?
Boy, Mary, I can't thank you enough for encouraging me to come and visit this beautiful place. Look at that. do a video in and by itself right here. Beautiful. Where there's just so much to look at in here. And then interesting, they have these silver, silver, I don't know what you would call that, but then where the face is, they actually have it cut out with a, with a painting inside. Look at that. I'm not quite sure what this is. Chairs lining the lining the wall. Looks like he's Jesus quick curing the lepers. Just beautiful. Look at that. the view for you. Alright. We're really special.
another one of those silver. Look at this. You can see that or not. She's asking them to place a candle up there for her. What a beautiful, beautiful lady. <laughs> All right. She was asking them to help her put a... You know who's in charge in here. Okay, folks. Look at that. Just beautiful. All right. So now I'm going to light a candle. Mom, this is for you. Hopefully you're going to see this video. But uh, light a candle here for you, Mom, in Athens. And tell you I love you. And say a little prayer for you. All right, we have a sunset to watch. All right, see, see them lowering the, the flag there. And uh, just as they're lowering the flag, the crowd is gathering for the, uh, crowd is gathering for the sunset here. And I have an opportunity to capture that for you. Wonderful. Starting to get really chilly up here. And the sun will be going down in yet another 15 or 15 or 20 minutes as they lower the flag. And you can see the quite a few people have gathered up here at the top to catch the sunset. And I happen to grab myself a prime spot right here. I hope that there is uh, hope we have the opportunity to see the uh, see the sunset Sun is uh, sun is going behind the clouds and it's illuminating illuminating the clouds, giving us a rather spectacular view. Look at that. 
Beautiful. And it is getting chilly. All right, so there is the Parthenon, as I was just told by a lovely lady here on the top of the of the hill looking down. And you can see that would be the Acropolis. The Acropolis is actually the the hill or the mountain, and then on top you have the, the Parthenon. And uh, the sun is just... Uh, just going down I don't know how well you can actually actually see it but there there's your beautiful there's your beautiful sky look at it turning different shades of yellow red orange beautiful just beautiful All right, we'll wait just a little bit longer and then wrap this video up. There's a view looking, looking down. There's a view looking down of the folks catching the sunset from a little bit lower perspective. If only to give you the full experience, I'm going to do a 360 pan here and show you the show you the crowd, and that'll give you an idea as to the great spot that I've got. And it is just about five o'clock here in Athens and you can hear the bells tolling all around the city as the sun is saying goodbye to this beautiful beautiful city look at that you can hear you can hear the bells tolling all around the city of Athens there's your sunset folks beautiful There is the there's the Acropolis with the Parthenon. All right. Hope you enjoyed this beautiful experience. I was like, what the fuck? How can you complain about this? Look at that. Have a good uh, have a good day. You know, I keep thinking that I'm finished with the video and I come across something else to share and I'm on my way back down and you can see these folks here. They, uh, they opted to watch the, watch the sun go down here from a different, little different angle and it's an every, every bit as beautiful as where I was standing up, uh, up on the top. So it won't be long and they will be lighting up the Parthenon on the Acropolis over there. So now this should be the uh, should be the end of the video, folks. Have a uh, have a great day. All right. So there you have it. It <coughs> it lit up. No sooner had I shut the camera off, and there is the uh, Acropolis with the Parthenon all lit. So have a uh, have a wonderful day.